Hey everyone and welcome back to another Fallout 76 video on the channel. In the new Season 16 update coming March the 26th, we're said to be getting a brand new weapon added to the game. This weapon is going to be called the Cremator and it's very similar to the Incinerator that we've seen in Fallout New Vegas. Now from the recent dev dive that Bethesda shared, we can now confirm that this weapon should definitely be coming into the game and it will be getting added through the new Season 16 scoreboard where it will be unlockable at currently the rank of rank number 22. Now from what I've seen and read so far from different data miners and stuff is this is going to be a two-handed kind of heavy automatic incendiary weapon so yes it's going to be flames. Now with the flamer being such a popular choice of weapon I'm kind of really looking forward to seeing how everyone reacts to this one and whether it'll actually be a really popular weapon in the game and just really basically praying that it doesn't turn out to be something like the pepper shaker which looked so good came in everyone thought it was brilliant and then when it actually came into the game it proved to be a little bit of a waste of time. Now on top of the weapon itself being added into the new season, there's also a new skin that's been found to match it, and this is going to be the new Rip Daring Cremator skin. Now I know it's only one skin, but the main important thing is this will stop you from scripting it in at the machine, so happy days about that. Now there's also going to be a new interesting way of working when it comes to the actual mods for the weapon. As it appears on the dev dive and stuff, we're actually going to get these appearing in the season itself, where you're going to be able to buy them with the new ticket format. I'm not going to speak too much on that, but I've seen a lot of hate about it, but realistically I think this is actually a really great new addition, so just keep it in a, like an open mind. Now currently, thanks to Sugarbomb Rads, who's shared all these images with me that I've been showing off in this video, I do have a few new images of a few of the new tank mods, which you can unlock in the seasons, and it should allow you to change the colours of the actual flames that the weapon gives off. Now from the images I have, there is currently a blue, green, and a pink all available, which you can apply to the weapon, and of course there will also be the default colour, which will be like the red-orange colour that, of, of course, fire actually normally is. In terms of the actual damage of the weapon, I have seen a few conversations about it, but I don't want to share the exact figures or anything just yet for the fact that this may change, it's still the PDS, they're still working on the changes and stuff, so we'll just have to wait and see in a few weeks' time when it actually gets released. The only thing I have kind of seen as the main concern is it is an automatic weapon, so don't expect it to one-shot things, because it's, yeah, you know, it's automatic, like, automatic weapons are a bit weaker than the single-shot ones. That all being said, though, this is definitely a weapon that I'm interested in seeing in the game, but what do you think about it? Could this be a weapon that you want to play with and do you think it's actually going to be a good addition to the game let me know down in the comments below for now though that's all the info i have to share with you guys so stay tuned in case i hear or see anything else but that though is the end of the video so i hope you all did enjoy if you did make sure to click on that like button and if you're new around here don't forget to subscribe thanks for watching bye bye